checking out the heat on paper. Baron Mamiya taking on Keone Yan, Imai Kalani Duvall, and Hank Gaskell. Hard to pick winners in this one as well. Baron Mamiya has been the one on fire. Triple crown rookie of the year. As we'll get caught up with this heat in the lineup. Surfer in the white jerseys, Keone Yan. Yeah, well, have a look at that. Nice little way to start the heat for Keone Yan. Uh, just in and out of the barrel. You can see setting it up, driving through that first section. Beautiful positioning and uh, comes out nice and clean. So, nice way to start. You want to Little opportunity out front. Hey, Gasco. Oh, tough positioning there. He's down. Baron Mamiya still on his feet, looking for a little bonus inside corner. Look at that technique from Baron. I mean, that was insane right there. A real small board yet again. Grabbing that rail, sliding, using his body to, to, to give him that extra point of contact on the wave. I do. I got last in that final. I remember <laughs> that well. <laughs> Some beautiful conditions out here, though, Joe. The wind is just, if there isn't any wind, it's so light. Uh, it most probably could do with a little more grooming. If there was a little more wind, it would smooth out because as this swell came to us, it actually had a lot of wind on it. And it's been windy and bumpy, and there's a bit of that residual bump in the lineup now. Billabong Pro of Pipe to seal that deal as number one in the world. Having a look at another tough wipeout for Hannah Hank Gaskell. Point eight on his first, another similar score. Locking in Mamiya. Slides out on the takeoff, but he is in total control. Coming up next, having a look now, pulling in, standing tall. Hank Gaskell goes down. During the break, once again, Hank Gaskell pulling in to several backdoor barrels. This time he gets the exit. Wow, well, if it, if at first it doesn't work, try, try, try again. And that's exactly what Hank's done. He's had a couple of crazy wipeouts. He's been stuffed. He's got everything less than a point up until now. And look at this, driving through this section. Unbelievable, a lot of white water on the face. That thing is collapsing. Shriki up and over the foam ball. Chandeliers galore. And you can see how far up the board he was, Joe. And look at that. I think the best score of the day. Nine-point ride for Gaskell. Emai Kalani on the next one. Way too deep. And Emai's down. But coming off a massive number for Hanna Hank. Nine points for one of the best numbers of the day. Olamana Iligram with that big approach to take the win a couple of heats ago. Now Gaskell's turn here. Wow, Joe. Nine points on that occasion. See how he's fighting, and, and it is a really chunking, and I just want to watch this one of White. Ooh. Over the falls for Keanu Yan. Incomplete there still with head judge Richie Porta. Nice to see those comparisons underway. I know you're watching this. We'll let Richie Porta get back to biz now with Baron Mamiya, a bomb drop. Twice. So if you can uh, sort of come to grips with that, I think, then you just let your surf and do the talking, and... This one right here, free falls out of the sky, that front foot, oh my gosh. Hank Gaskell locks in, great positioning, super deep. Comes out with the low road, and Gaskell flies away, backing up a nine point ride. This one continues with Emai Kalani Duvall packing this one, super deep, spits first, and Emai oh. can't get the exit. Two beautiful waves back to back from back door. Barton, it looks like the waves are getting better and better heat by heat. What's really changed in your mind of the approach these days at back door? Oh, back doors, are, you know, there were events, Pipeline Masters, where people didn't go right because they were actually judged from the uh, beach park and they couldn't see the rights. When it comes to competing and free surfing, a back door pipeline coming up next. Straightening out on a big takeoff is Keone Yan. You can see where he's positioned. Here we go, having a look at this one. This is Mumia. Late takeoff, all skill to manufacture the barrel there. I think he's still going to need something. Let's have a look though. Look at the technique as he just falls out of the sky. Very a la John John uh, Jamie kind of uh, approach. Very simple. That's true. Also expecting Emai Kalani maybe to have a late charge. It is Baron Mumia. Knowing this local lineup so well, found himself a place to try to fight back, laying low for the completion, uh -huh. and somehow survives. So knowing that he had to get credit for riding away free. It was tricky, I mean, got barreled, took off, slid in, then crumbled on him. 
now he's got to fight his way out. Comes out the bottom of the wave. Not a clean exit, kind of a messy exit, but amazing ability, amazing balance, amazing technique to be able to come out of that and finish that wave off. Giving himself all the opportunity as possible, but is that going to be enough, Joe? Unbelievable effort for Baron Mamiya. Going down, not getting the score on the 2-9. Gets a 3.53, and it's oh. not enough. Baron ends up in third. Emai Kalani stays in fourth. And Keone Yan breathes a sigh of relief, moves on underneath. Hank Gaskell as this round continues.